New at 6 o'clock tonight, a Liberty County deputy shot in the line of duty nearly four months ago is slowly recovering. Deputy Richard Witten spent four weeks in the ICU, surviving several health complications, and now he's been moved to Tier Memorial Herman. Channel 2's Bill Barajas, the only local TV reporter to speak with Deputy Witten about his recovery. Bill? Well, Deputy Witten has been here since uh, June 27th. There's no timetable for when he may be able to go home, but I can tell you he's making real progress. Small victories, each and every exercise. <laughs> a building block in Deputy Richard Witten's road to recovery. I'm a God-fearing man. I believe in miracles. I believe that, uh, you know, he, he has a plan for each and every one of us. Witten's faith never wavered. Not even at the very moment his life was forever changed. In doing this job, like I said, you got to have the warrior mindset and you got to be, be ready to watch one another's back. Because things happen quick out here. The day was May 29th. Witten was on duty when he was dispatched to a shooting scene in Cleveland. Three people had been shot. Witten was charged with pulling over the suspect. I hollered at him twice. Show me your hands, show me your hands. Before I knew it, he pulled a gun up on the right side where I couldn't see him at all and took a shot. And I don't know if it was a lucky shot or not, but he got me. The suspect later shot and killed himself. Witten was taken by life flight to the hospital with a gunshot wound to the neck. He was initially paralyzed from the chest down, but thanks to his rehab, he now has movement in his right arm. Oh, no. His wife, Cammie, has been by his side since the beginning, always watching, cheering, and providing motivation when needed. Telling me, you know, hey, look, we're going to get through this if I got to, you know, kick you in the butt to make it happen. And Deputy Witten says he has no regrets. He'd do it all over again, and he hopes to one day rejoin the Liberty County Sheriff's Office. Live from the Medical Center, Bill Barajas, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Bill.